My daughter had warned me that there was an, quote, Asian cop down by Ocean Beach that caused all kinds of problems for her and her boyfriend. So my very first day in Ocean Beach, guess who just walks up and starts standing next to us? So my daughter's boyfriend got arrested. Her and I went to OB, and the very first, I mean, minutes after we arrived, guess who just walks up and starts standing right next to us? I thank you for videotaping this encounter. I appreciate it. No problem. That makes both of us. My name is Sergeant Neal of the San Diego Police Department, ID number 5643. Got constant complaints regarding the security of narcotics and uh -huh. that nature. I'm addressing it. I said hello to you. My name is Sergeant Neal of the San Diego Police Department, ID number 5643. Got constant complaints regarding the security of narcotics and uh -huh. that nature. I'm addressing it. I said hello to you. I said hello. Just having a nice conversation. I'm standing here. And that's pretty much it. So you have any questions for me? Uh, yeah. Did you practice that speech? What's that? No, I did no? not practice. Okay. I get enough people shoving their cameras in my face and food matter. Is that you what? You're very, being very polite, which I appreciate. Oh, I do my best. So I enjoy Ocean Beach, but you know people have complained regarding that. Oh, I'm, I'm sure they have. It's a... Oh, they have tremendous concern. I walk here about five, six hours a day. Yeah. And I talk to a lot of citizens and they tell me about their concerns. Yeah, I so understand. I please record and I encourage that. Have I a good... All the people come to all righty. That is not uh, what's it, canned or rehearsed. It's something I say I hear you have your own dojo. Is that true? So you know a lot about me. So I do. Tell you're you're famous. Tell I hear. I know you have your own dojo. Okay, tell me about my dojo. No, tell me about your dojo. You asked me first. I, I asked if you had one. I don't. And have then one. you got defensive. I don't know. I'm asking you. I don't have one. Oh, okay. I guess I heard wrong. Yes, you did hear wrong. Ah. Is it tough being an Asian policeman? You're being racist now? Sir? No, I'm asking if it's difficult with racism within the department if they I treat you differently. It doesn't matter. I am an American, so that's all that matters to me. Yeah. What's, what's my race have to do with any concern? No, I'm just because that? other police officers... Let me ask you this. Are you trying to antagonize me? Because that seems like a lot of the travelers try to do with their camera, try to antagonize me. So do your very best to antagonize me. I don't care. Are you like those British guards that stand there stoically? No, well, I don't like that at all, sir. Okay. You got me mistaken for somebody else. Okay. You checked to see if her video went viral? Yes. Really? How maybe did you I did, maybe I didn't. How'd you check? I don't know, maybe I really didn't check. Yeah, maybe you just made that part up. Maybe. Probably. Yeah, that's what I thought. Maybe I make a lot of things up. I have no doubt. Oh, I also know... Good seeing you. You're staying out of trouble, right? Oh, yeah. You were under the influence last time I right? You know what I love about you, Dave? You're a terrible liar. I noticed your shoulder went up when you were talking about her boyfriend, when you said that he had been antagonistic. Do you know something about her boyfriend that you weren't telling us? Classic one-sided shrug. Translation, I have absolutely no confidence in what I just said. The body contradicts the words. He's lying. Dave? Sir, so do you have a question? Stand yeah. back. I'm, I'm asking you a question. Do not approach me, so I'm standing in my feet area. Please stand in your area. Okay. I'm minding my own business. I don't know why you're You asked you. me if I had a why question. Why are you antagonizing? You asked me about the dojo? I just told you, sir. You didn't tell me anything. You, you me, talked... You didn't record that portion where you said, do you have a dojo? You only record what you want to record. So why don't you have the camera on when we first made our contact? I did. No, you didn't. Sir. You want to see the footage, dumbass? Well, show it to someone else, sir. I really don't care for you right now. Please stay away from me. You came into my where we were and oh, stood right is, next is to us. Is it your area? Is that what you're saying? Is it yours? No, that's where I'm standing here. No, just just coincidentally, you came over and started antagonizing us then. How did I antagonize you? Really? How did I antagonize you? Really? See, I walk here. I walk here a lot. So uh -huh. People say, hey, there's some people. I'm not so sure. I've never seen them before. So I stood here making sure everything's... Someone said that to you about us? All the time. Not only you, about well, I mean about us specifically. Because we just got here and then you walked up and stood People's next to us. Saw a group. Who said that? You were over there. I know. How could you possibly... Oh, somebody... We, we put our stuff down 
homeless people, and then someone ran over to you and told they you. Run over, sir. People flagged me down all the time. Flagged, flagged you down. I was over there say, there's a guy who potentially passed out on the wall. So this guy. I said over there in the cliffs. Ah. Are you? No, your job is to antagonize me, son, and you're doing a great job. But I'm not going to fall for it because I know exactly what you're doing, and I got you on tape lying twice. So, yeah, well, so we're good. Do what you need to do. All right. Thank you. Maybe if I stare at him, he'll leave. So, can I ask you a question? No. Well, your questions are more harassing, sir. So I think we're done talking. I'd like an answer to the question, though. It's kind of important. I think we're done talking. Okay. Your harassing nature to antagonize me is not a cool thing. Is that what's happening, or are you projecting? Uh, you're a lot smarter than me, so these fancy words you're using, I don't know what you're talking about. It means that you're actually the one who's antagonizing, but you're saying I am because you're not willing to admit that you're being the asshole. I work here. How you doing, guys? Dave is going to stand right there by us till we leave, I guess. Supposedly, within 30 seconds of us showing up here, someone ran all the way down there and told him that there were creepy-looking homeless people here. Or is that another one of Dave's lies? I think that's another one of Dave's lies. No adults would carry from that to say. By the way, Dave Dave would be being here because she was being a, you know. What's that? Do you have such low self-esteem that you had to tell me that woman was thankful for you to try to rub it in my face that I'm not? Honestly? Because that's sad, Dave. That's embarrassingly sad, Dave. All right, after Dave. Make sure you pick up all your trash, sir, and be mindful of the community. Okay? Oh, absolutely. And remember, liar. Don't harassing anybody, okay? Liars never prosper. Okay, I appreciate that. Sir. Okay. So keep being honest, okay? I will. Now you should try it sometime. You'll be very prosperous. Keep honest. Thank you. So I was at a park near the beach, sleeping when I got woken by Sergeant Yu's boot. Since Sergeant Yu doesn't have a body camera, conveniently. Uh, you're going to have to go with the footage once I finally got my camera on. Just for the record, he's calling this in. My stuff all over the place. This is my bag. I have one little lean-to. Meanwhile, over there, there's a tent right there. Where people have a full tent. There's a tent right there. There's a full tent right there. There's another tent right there. But this guy's harassing me because I have a piece of tarp laid out. I'm not How am I harassing you? I said you're good. Who'd you just call? Don't worry about who I called. No, who'd you just call in about my stuff being all over the place? I didn't say that. I just heard you tell Someone on that phone, well, his no, stuff is all over the place. Don't worry about who I'm calling. Are you harassing me now? I'm moving along, sir. It's my job. Well, you just called it in. I'm just curious who you were calling. Don't worry about who I call. Oh, I'm worried. I'm so worried. I'm going to make another call, in fact. Are you? Yeah. About how nervous you are when I stand behind you? Is that well, what you're calling me? It's a bad idea to stand behind an officer. I know. Well, for your benefit, don't do that. I wouldn't. You could, of course, leave me the fuck alone, and then then this well, wouldn't I, be a problem. Sir, I can stay in this park. It's a public park. Is this your park? I, I can stand behind you. It's a public park. Okay, then stand there. Are you want me to stand behind you? Okay. Yeah, you can stand behind me. Okay. I thought you said that made that makes you nervous. Well, don't come any closer. That's all. Matters. Oh, okay. I want to make you nervous while you stand here and harass me. How am I harassing you? You're harassing me now with that camera following me around when I make my phone calls. Your phone calls about me, but not about all the other people who are camping. How do you know it's about you? Am I retarded? I or did I hear you. what you just said? How about you? Maybe I didn't make any phone call. Maybe I was just... Oh, you just faking a phone call because you're a lying piece of shit? Maybe that's it. And I wake up to this asshole. So oh, what do you wake want? You up, sir. Someone flagged me down. We've gotten all this stuff. Can you uh, video and zoom around this area? Yeah, let's Can do that. Can you stand that. up and do that? This whole area, please? Well, those aren't me. Well, do the whole area, please. 
And people just saying, check the well from a person. So this is my stock and my basket. And then I'm laid out at the beach. Let's be clear, we're not on a city street, but the beach. I came up to you and I said, are you okay? What are you doing? And you say, F off, a-hole. Did you not say that? You said, what? Did you not say that, sir? You were asking about my welfare. Yeah, and then what did you say to me? It's you just lied place. to me? You said, give me a ticket. Did you not say that? Well, you said that I had to leave. You weren't no, I, asking I about my ask welfare. I didn't ask you to leave. I said, I think you're borderline encroaching. You have stuff all over the place and people are wondering if you're okay. I said, are you okay? Did I not ask you that? Wow, uh, you are just one. Did I not ask you that, sir? Fucked up asshole, aren't you? So you're just making things up, are you? So write me the ticket, son. Well, or go or like leave me the fuck alone. Those are your choices. By the way, I'm not your son, sir. So either write me the ticket or leave me the fuck alone. Aren't you the guy who harassed me last time with the camera? I'm glad you brought the camera out. Sir. You asked me to bring the camera out, well, asshole. Because you started using profanity for whatever reason. I want to document this. You don't have your camera going? I don't have a camera yet, sir. You don't have a camera yet? Aren't you a sergeant? I asked you nicely. Why do you have to cuss and be all rude for, man? I asked you nicely, everything okay? And then you started cussing for no, no reason. No, you didn't. You told me that this was borderline encroachment. And well, you, you are, because you got your stuff all over the place. It's not cool. It's the beach, asshole. Do you not know you're at the beach? Are you that stupid? Unbelievable. So are we done? I'm gonna stay. We're not done. Oh, you're just gonna stand right next to me like you did last time, harassing me, helping to prove the point. I'm harassing you. Really? You start cussing at me and getting all belligerent. That's that's how this began. It didn't begin exactly. with you coming yeah, no, over and threatening so, me. How did I threaten you, sir? Well, you said this was borderline encroachment. Because you have stuff all over the place. I have, have I lean to, and this isn't mine. You can have this back because I had nothing to do with oh, this. So now that's, not that's, that's not mine. Can you document this? That's not mine. You're not going to take that with you. I had nothing to do with it. So someone said it problem. there. Is that your reason? Anything? So you had someone set that there, and now you're using that as a reason to yes, harass I, me? Uh, I've set that up, and I planted that next to you. So I can is, that, is that why? That's what I did all day today. Yeah. So you're not going to take your trash? That's not mine. So whose is it? I don't know. I woke up and it was there, just like you. I woke up and that trash was there and this trash was so there. I came up here. Double trash. Says, what are you doing here to me? So are we done? Well, you're going to pick that trash up? That's not mine. Well, then we're not done. You're going to get a citation for that. I'm going to get a citation for something that's not mine. Well, it's on your property. So oh, it was on my property, so it's mine. Yes. Wow. Well, I'll go throw that away. I thank you very much. Asshole. This is me throwing somebody else's trash away because that police officer decided he's gonna mess with me again. So it never ends. On here. But just to be sure, we're at the beach. There's people with tents there. Someone's got a full tent right there. But this cop, this cop is bothering me because I raised up a piece of tarp to block the sun. Correct? You're not bothering those people who have actual tents up right there? Just me, correct? Well, I asked if you're doing okay. I mean, you're, look at how you're behaving compared to other people behaving. Well, they're not being harassed by you again. How am I harassing you? I asked you, are you okay? What are you doing? Is that your trash? And you started yelling and cussing at me, yes or no? No. So you didn't? No, that's not how it happened. Okay, then you're right and I'm wrong. Good. Are we done? Well, I'm done, are you All right, done? then bye. <laughs> I, I missed that part on the camera. You're not going anywhere. You're just going to stand right next to me again, but not be harassing me, correct? You just woke me up to tell me that I am on borderline well, encroachment, well, but people... When you started cussing at me and then saying, and once you get the F Was I not sleeping you when not you walked that? up? No, when I came up here, I said, you're all right. You opened your eyes and started cussing at me. Yes or no? So before I opened my eyes, no, I was asleep. I Is that know, what you don't you? understand? I don't know. Are you that stupid? Are you literally that stupid? Why don't yeah. you videotape yourself doing that, sir? Oh, there's some things I'd like to videotape me doing, but this will be good enough. But he's not harassing me or anything. No, sir, the understanding of harassment is you harassing other people is the problem. I just walk here and I walk here and make sure everything's okay. You tend to be very loud and boisterous and you know, profane, which you have a right to do so, but you can't be bothering other people. Would you agree that you're, not, you're bothering other people, yes or no? No, you can't answer that, can you? I was sleeping until you walked up. How is that bothering people?
how am I, you know, a person down call regarding check the welfare, so you can get okay. And then all you, you have to say is, You got a call? A You're telling me I that someone say, made hey, a call? I walk here, people flag me down. Someone flagged you down and said, there's a homeless guy laying at the beach, no, you should check hey, on him. I have no idea if you're homeless or not. Really? Hey, thank you for cleaning that up. Really? You, you have no idea if... He had no idea if I was homeless. I have no idea. I don't know you. I know last time you just came up on me when I was doing nothing. You stuck a camera in my face. Is that how that. it happened? How did it happen? Let's then? have a flashback. Okay, you record it, so show it. Here's the last time we saw this asshole. You checked to see if her video went viral? Yes. Really? How did you? Maybe I did. How'd you check? I don't know, maybe I really didn't check. Yeah, maybe you just made that part up. Maybe. Yeah, that's what I thought. Maybe I make a lot of things up. I have no doubt. I also that's the last time he was messing with us. Oh, I wonder what's going to happen the next time. Because you know there'll be a next time. Because he's an asshole. Terrible liar. You're the one who's always right. Remember what I just said? I'm just an idiot like you said, right? Is that what you said? You don't have to go here. All you have to do is communicate like a normal, proper human being. No, you have to cuss and be rude and be obnoxious about things. Which is kind of a, not a problem, but it's kind of rude. You're killing the vibe over here, man. You understand that? You don't bother me at all. I work here. But the people who live here are getting kind of a little bit fed up with this type of behavior. Step back, please. Don't come any closer. I don't bother you? What's that? I thought I didn't bother you. Well, you don't, but don't come any closer. It's for my safety issue. Uh -huh. If you come any closer, it's going to be a problem, sir, for your sake, for me as well. So please, I'm going to move back a little bit. Don't do that anymore. I thank you very much. That nervous he got. Well, I don't know. You might have a knife. I don't know what your capabilities are. I mean, you're well, you're welcome. Really you're welcome to search me when you give me the ticket. I don't need to search you, sir. No? No. Why aren't you concerned for your welfare? Well, if you come any closer, I will be. What if I just move real quick this way? Well, then move back up by all means. Oh, that okay? That's fine. Did he jump? I was too busy moving real quick. I'm not that quick, so you're okay. Lucky you. Yeah, but he's gonna stand right there. He is not bothering me though. He's just gonna stand right there. And not harass me. Well, if you're not doing anything wrong, you got nothing to worry about, right? That's a big difference. When people bother other people, they don't feel comfortable. They're bothered. I was sleeping, asshole. Now he's literally walking circles around me. But again, he's not harassing me or anything. He's just circling around me. So now, because it's not enough for him to be harassing me, now these narcs sitting right next to me are gonna be having some kind of a loud I don't even know what's going on bullshit literally walking circles around me what's that? What's that? What happened to that girl that you were traveling with? Remember a few weeks ago when you guys were harassed me underneath the bridge? With, uh... Because I'm now beginning to feel harassed. How am I harassing you? Can you please leave me alone now? Well, you don't have to talk to me. I'm gonna stand right here and enjoy the day. You're harassing me just like you did when I was at the pier. You just came out of nowhere and started cussing at me. And you gotta understand, I work here and I walk here a lot. Can you please lot. stop harassing me? All right, I'm done talking to you. Are we done talking? It's never done, is it? Never. Ever done. Fuck you! Fuck you! You piece of shit!
it's a popping shot. What's your name and badge number? Can you stand right there, please? My name is uh, Sergeant Dave Yu, ID number 5643. 5643, U is spelled YU. That's correct. And the armband, the little black band he wears over that is ironic, because he's not really a cop. He's a piece of shit. Can you step back, please? You're just bothering me at this point in time. You can do whatever you want, but quit you know, encroaching on me and bothering me, okay? You use that word encroaching a lot. Is that the biggest word you know? Could be, sir. What's that? Do you have any ID? I do have ID. Okay, can you take out your ID, please? Sure. Thank you. Can you tell me what you give me a ticket for? For having a glass bottle in the park. So after all that circling around and doing this, this is what he gets me for, having a glass bottle in the park. Well, so I saw that earlier on. I just don't want you to didn't say anything about it. Well, I saw, I saw that. Oh, you had a call back up? Yes. Oh, that's what's happening. If you okay. have a body worn camera, I'll make sure that. Yeah, hey, well, I definitely want want this for the records and all. Let's see if I can take out my wallet. Definitely want this for the records. Go, Chief. Is this your current address? This is my current address, son. What's that? This right here. Where you're citing me for having a glass bottle, which I use for protection. You never okay. know one of those so assholes I'll use, sneaks I'll up use, on you. I'll uh, use 2083 Sunset Cliffs, I guess is your address. Then. Whatever you fucking please. Okay. Here we go. Put this in the ticket pile, right? I'd like you to call your supervisor to the scene, please. Because I have documentation of you specifically harassing me, including making, faking a phone call just to, to harass me because I'm homeless. So I'd like your supervisor, please. I have the supervisor, sir. Well, there, you have to have a supervisor, and if the supervisor is doing something that is causing problems, like harassing people intentionally, then you have to have a supervisor. So you I'd like to call speak. that in right now. The supervisors are busy. Well, who is your supervisor? It's Lieutenant Carter. Lieutenant what? Carter. Carter? Yes. It's the first time I've heard your voice crack in this entire endeavor. Does Lieutenant Carter make you nervous? Yes. Good. Oh, he's not on camera. Let's make sure. Uh, Sergeant McGass all over here. Get the whole gang in the shot. By shot, I mean camera shot. Don't get nervous. Would you agree while you were sitting here, five other people joined you around here and started smoking? Were you aware of that? You're saying five people started smoking around no, me? I said one, and there was five around here. What are you talking about? I don't understand your question. Okay. So strangers have no having nothing to do with me smoked by me, and that's my fault? Why? I didn't say it was your fault. Well, then what are you asking me? I answered that I have no idea what the fuck you're talking about. You know, people don't want to hear that. I don't care right? because I have the First Amendment speech I know you do, to but say fuck I'll just you. Be, I'll just be polite as fuck you. I know, but there's people fuck and kids you. walking around. Well, then stop harassing people. Maybe harassing they maybe you. they don't want to watch you well, harass you. Shouldn't have a glass bottle in the park. Oh, is that, right that the this, problem? Posted. Is that the? Oh, this whole problem is because I had a glass bottle at the park. It's one of the problems, sir. Uh, yeah, we can finish that out, and I want you to dispose that, please. Absolutely. Thank you. Well, I so look forward to seeing you in court. Okay, sir. I'll see you in court. One way or another. Are you threatening me, sir? Are you retarded? 
What's that? Are you retarded? What's that, sir? Are you retarded? I don't appreciate that term. Well, you're asking me such ridiculous questions. I think it's a legitimate question whether or not you're retarded. Are you threatening me is what I asked you. How was I threatening you? Did, did you not come at me in a jerky manner, but yet, man, you know, asking me to react a certain way? You videotaped that, did you not? Well, you told me I couldn't stand behind you, yeah, but then you... Yeah, I don't want you standing behind well, me. Well, it's all so on tape. So we, we can... It, right? we'll, they'll see it in the tape. Well, you have it on the recording, sir. Yes, That's we good. do. You try to antagonize me. Is that you. how this began? Yes. Really? We'll see what a jury thinks. All right. Okay, sir. So the infraction is 63.0102B, parentheses 7, which is uh, no glass bottles in parks. Okay, that's the San Diego Municipal Code. It's an infraction. Here's your ID. By signing in the red box, it doesn't mean you're guilty of anything. It just means you promise to appear in court. I put the date as 8-30-16. There you go, sir. Do you have any questions? No. Nope. I suggest if you want to come out here and uh, hang out at the parks and the beach, you familiarize yourself with the posted sign. Okay? <laughs> yeah, that's my problem. Can you throw the bottle non familiary No, I'm going to pack up and leave. Well, can you throw it away? No, I'm keeping the bottle because it's my bottle of water. Well, if it's going to stay here, you're going to. Well, I just it. said I'm packing up and leaving, so it's obviously leaving no, with me. I'm putting it in my backpack right now. Thank you. I clearly answered the question of whether or not you're retarded. Though. If you're talking in a non hostile manner, why don't you shut the you. fuck up? How about that? Bye bye now. Well, sir, it's a bye free bye now. I can speak. Yeah, you sure can. Thank you for pointing out that it's a free country. That's a real genius, this one. Just be more respectful. Uh -huh. It's a simple ask. You know what I'm talking about. I walk here all the time, people complain about your type of behavior. Using profanity because it's a First Amendment right. I mean, what do you about other people who live here? Kids, family. Don't you care about them? I know you have rights, but be a little bit mindful and respectful is all I ask, man. Not too much to ask. Wow. Sir, I waited until you turn on the camera. Can you put your uh, camera on the cigarette and the lighter? You're about to smoke as I approached you. I asked you not to smoke here. As soon as the officers leave, you start smoking up. I mean, I asked you not to do that. And please, get rid of your glass bottle. I mean, is that too much to ask? You know, if we weren't here, you'd be smoking right now. Yes or no? The answer is yes, so put away your cigarette and smoke elsewhere, okay? You can't smoke in the parking lot, you can't smoke in the park, you smoke on the sidewalk. Do you understand? I do. Right, so why do you have to do that? I watched you earlier on from the lifeguard tower, you were smoking, I didn't have enough units to come here and give you a citation, but you're going to have to stop doing that and be a little bit more courteous. And I asked you that several times before. I don't understand your question, officer. What? I don't understand your question. I was just curious, because he gave me shit because I was smoking a cigarette. Yeah. And he told me he'd take me to jail. And I was just trying to talk to him, be nice, but he was like, there was no talking to him because he's, he's an asshole. So I wasn't sure. Okay. Next time I'll just do the same thing you did, and then okay. hopefully it works the same way. Yeah, I know, huh? All right, then, bye. What's up? I said, all right, then, bye. All right, man. Have a good one. You too, officer. I'm not an officer, but okay. Two days later, I am asleep at a park near the beach, and I am awoken once again by Sergeant Yu's boot. And this time, he brought his buddies. Actually, he brought his whole crew. They're not harassing me. The same cop I posted the video of harassing me twice yesterday decides to hold his meeting 
See, I'm sleeping right here. And now I'm surrounded by four police cars so we can hold this meeting right where I'm sleeping. I'm laying right here. But he's not fucking with me. No, I'm imagining that. Oh, here comes a fifth one. Great. Oh, that'll mean six cops are gonna have their meeting right around where I was laying. Just coincidentally. We have our meeting here when we do our here. You just, I mean, what are you talking about? I have a hard time sleeping because I have five staples in my head. So every time I try to lay on that side, the five staples jab into my scalp and it hurts and it wakes me up. So I was napping in the middle of the day. Napping in the middle of the day, as far as I know, is not a crime. So lucky. Eating donuts. Seven cops. Just to be clear, I have a severe head wound that I'm still recovering from after being woken with a rock to the head about a week ago. So I'm taking a nap in the afternoon. Two days in a row, the same asshole wakes me up. It is, by the way, in violation of the Geneva Convention to use sleep deprivation as a method of torture. But here's how the asshole woke me today. I was going to sleep under that tree for the afternoon, a little relaxed a little bit. But there were two police cars there, so I'm under this tree. But guess who shows up? So you're having a meeting here, is that the deal? We're doing our paper is going to meet me here so they can sign off on the paper. By the way, this is where the MLB, the Major League, all the little kids are playing here today. And they want to walk here undisturbed. So that's all. I don't know why you're bothering me with that camera. Have my why eyes. I'm bothering you? He wants to know why I'm bothering him with this camera. Well, I parked in the shade here. Uh, is that you were parked? You guys were parked right over in the shade yeah, there. You was not here. How's that? I just got over here. What are you talking? There were two about? police officers, yeah, officer cars other, parked right. But those were my other two officers. They were supposed to be in Rawfield, make sure that the kids were enjoying themselves without being. Uh, and of all, you can't park over there. Well, the shade's not big enough for all my other officers. The shade's bigger over there. Well, I don't know, so I'm not gonna, I mean, this is where I choose to stop. I mean, is this Do you your, choose to stop where I am at? Is this your park, though? Hey, can I ask you a question? Why are you flipping off my officers at the drive by? They have enough stress after what happened. When did I they flip off your... an officer driving by? What's that? What are you talking about? You want to see the picture that I just got and you flipped into my officers off? Yeah. You want to see it? Yes. Okay, stand right here, please. Let me show you the picture. Please. And I want you to document this. Yeah. I mean, it's not illegal to do that, but, you know, couldn't you give them a break? And they're trying to work here, and, you know, they don't need you yussing and cussing at them and flipping them off. I mean, that's not cool. Yeah, I, tried to, I asked you yesterday, just be cool to people. You just can't seem to do that, man. You just seem to be very cool. And I don't know what your problem with the police. I problem isn't with the police anymore, asshole. It's with you. Well, that kind of language is not really a... a Fuck a you. You sick piece of shit. Is that you? You sick, lying piece of shit. Is that you? Is that me? Let me say, I can't quite see. Don't it. come near me, please. Is that you? Just come now. Is that you? Is that you flipping people off? Yes or no? Wow. I'm trying to see where that is. And plus, you're also on Facebook that people have mentioned you as well. So I'm trying to figure out where that was. You claim that happened today, huh? It happened today. You just said that happened today. I said, don't be flipping my officers off. You said that happened today. I don't know if I said that today. It I mean, didn't happen today. Probably did it. When did it happen then? I don't fucking know. And why were you flipping them off? Same reason I'm flipping you off. Because you're an asshole. That's really not necessary. Oh, it's more than necessary, you cocksucking piece of shit. You know, you've said that the people who live here as well, and that's what they're really upset I about. have? I've yeah. only said that to police officers. Uh, you know what? I've actually, people flag me down. That guy right You're there. You're lying about flagging down is just really getting old. Every time I've seen you, you've made up a lie about people flagging why you down I, as I an lie? excuse to fuck with me. Why would I lie? Sick piece of shit. Why would I lie about this? Because you're a sick piece of shit. Now, why would I lie? I just told you why. I mean, I have no issues with you, but people... Really? Really? You have no issues with me? You want to say that again? Yeah, I have no issues with you, sir. Then why do you keep fucking with me? If you don't smoke in public, in the uh, grass area, like I asked you before, if you don't have he has no, He has no issues with me, but I'm here, and this is where they're going to hold their meeting right now. It's a public park. But you're not fucking with me. Well, you can do whatever you want. Oh. I'm leaving you alone. You're the one cussing. You're leaving me alone. That's what hap what's happening here? Well, you do whatever you want to do. Quit, quit you cock-sucking piece of shit. 
That's supposed to bother me. I'm not in junior high school anymore. Really? Then stop acting like it. Well, I'm not the one using profanity. I'm using profanity because I'm not legally allowed to punch you in the fucking face. Are you threatening me now? No. Are I'm you, telling you why you, I'm swearing you at you, you cocksucking piece of shit. You're going to hit me. Are you retarded? I don't appreciate that term, too. Do you, are, you, are you literally retarded? Well, uh, Over 400 hits on yesterday's you fucking with me videos. But I look forward to your meeting. This is going to be fun. Let's have the meeting, asshole. Let's do it. All right. Yeah, they're not fucking with me. They're just deciding to have a meeting here because it's a public no, park. Why don't you shut the fuck up or arrest me? What Those are, are your choices. Arrest you for what? I don't know. I'm not here to arrest you. The then why don't you shut the fuck up? Was it yesterday? It was effort. He was setting up camp right in the middle of the sidewalk by CPS. Right in the middle of the sidewalk. Right people the want to enjoy it as much as he thinks. You think he owns the park. He owns the streets. And he has no consideration for other people. Unbelievable. I mean, I'll have one with the assholes. What's that? I'll have one with the assholes. You guys totally established his cover. What's that? You guys totally established his cover. What's that? That was well done. How's no, that? I totally don't think he's an undercover cop now. Lord have mercy. Eric? I know, sir. Hey, no smoking in the park. How'd you figure that out? Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, yeah Eric, I told you not to say it. We gotta use somebody else now. Well, right. You're too obvious. Well, I told you not to talk to him. But he came up to me. Return of Sergeant Doof Doofus McCastle. Let me see, let's see. Police Sergeant caught lying. Oh, this one has 300. Oh, that's by you. Yeah, oh, right. so just you, yesterday. You said 400 hits, it only has 300. Well, it's that's the two lie. videos. One has 200, oh, the other has 200. So You're together, that makes 400. I know you guys aren't good at math. The inevitable or the first one? The inevitable ones from yesterday. The lying ones from a couple weeks ago. Oh, is that the underneath the pier? Yeah. When people flag me down about you so When you drugs. lied about people flagging me flagging you down then, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's, oh, that's you. Oh, this was yesterday. We already we already know what happened yesterday. Uh, the inevitable uh, the first, first one. That one was caught lying. Yeah. How many minutes is that? I want to make sure you didn't edit things out. No, look. You're stalking me. That's kind of creepy. Yes, I'm stalking him. <laughs> Meanwhile, this is me at the park. Surrounded you got by more these thumbs up than, than thumbs down. That's because most people think he's an asshole. Oh, is that how you look at it? Yeah. I, I thought it was the other way. Is it thumbs up that he likes something that you just did? Thumbs down that you don't like. I don't know. I don't, I got it. Uh, where are all the comments? Go up. Go up. Just go up. No, you got to get that up. Okay. All through the end. Oh, okay. How meta is this? There's Sergeant Doofus McAsshole hey, actually hey, looking hey, hey, so calm. I'm trying to watch the video. Well, what's the video you posted and called me all these names? Is that you saying I should be punched multiple times because that is a threat on an officer? But all in light of what's going on, I think we should. Is that him? She did threaten him. Oh yeah, you gotta send me that because that's, I'm gonna show that to my my friends and family. Thank you, made thank you, made my day actually. Okay. Hey, we're, we we're not recording. You can stop recording. You can, you can record all he wants. I mean, he's gonna well the battery life on that thing is not that good. Hey, since you're recording, answer me this: uh, Why do you have to bother people and use profanity and flip people off I mean, randomly? 
I mean, you do that to me and other, I mean, I'm being dead serious. Why do you do that? I've had three, now four interactions with you. At each point, you have come up to me and intentionally tried to provoke me. How did I provoke you? Well, I have, you were just watching video of you provo provoking me, Why so it's not you? hard. I mean, the thing is, you're, 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 how do I provoke you? I work here. Let's see, there's much more shade under that tree, but he claims that this tree is the only place they can have their meeting, even though, wow, the guy he's been fucking with just happens to be right here. That's so just a coincidence this, though, is, right? Is, it, is this your tree? Is it a coincidence is that you're your fucking tree? with me is this today? Is your park? Is it yours? Let me ask you okay, this. Well, I can stand behind you again, right? You can stand behind me. I can me. stand right you fucking him, behind yeah, you. Yeah, he can stand it's, it's free park, right? Yeah, you can stand here as long as you don't come within uh, two arms length. So two right. arms length, huh? My legs are pretty capable. Mm, I'm sure they are with that dojo of yours. But you said I got kicked out of that dojo. Uh -huh. Did you say that? For being an asshole? Pretty much. So I understand what you're saying. So when people walk by you with their children and then they see you and you kind of give that dirty look and flip them off and they walk away, do they have a right to be where they want to go? Let me ask you that question. Yes, well, sir. none of that ever happened. It's never happened. No. Not once. No. Okay, I believe you. Like, it's never happened where you flip people off and use profanity. I'd show you a picture that. That never happened. You have a picture of me using profanity, do you? Well, I just had a picture of you flipping an officer off yesterday. Did I not? That was yesterday now. Yes. You keep changing when that picture yesterday, was. Today, I mean, you do it so often, I, I have no idea. I run into you because you seem to be lingering around everywhere. Really? People want to enjoy the area. So I'm not allowed to be here? No, you can be here all you want. Am I lingering where people are trying to enjoy it or am I allowed to be here? Which well, is you know it? what? People are intimidated by you when they're with their families and really? walking around. Yes. Really? They're intimidated by me sleeping here no, under this fucking by you tree. Smoking and making, you know, obnoxious loud profanity. Well, did I get a ticket for smoking? You got a ticket for having a glass bottle. Oh, well then I guess you don't have me smoking, do you? Well, you were, but I did not have an officer to give you a ticket because they were busy yesterday. Really? But the one was available for a, a bottle citation. So a bottle citation, but not a smoking citation? No, sir. Aww. You are just one sick son of a bitch, aren't you? Well, keep recording, sir, and enjoy. Yeah, we should be knocking off since I did the uh, morning. Uh, yeah. The out. Uh, <sighs> no, the guy is harassing people. We should be trying to pick them up. Whatever the fuck I want to edit, you cocksucking cool, piece of though. shit. If you're editing based on what you want, it's, it's not being fair and not balanced, you're lying. Why don't you just show the entire video the way it was from beginning to end and let the people see what kind of person Why don't you, you be the asshole cop and I'll be the filmmaker documenting your assholeness? How about that? Are you really a filmmaker? I was a film student out of San Diego State. You were not a filmmaker. Yes, film. I was. What year? I was graduated in 1988. Uh, you missed me. You missed me at the same film school. You missed me by what? I started in '94. You, you missed went to me. San Diego State. San Diego okay, State Film okay. School. What is the program called? Well, back then it was called the Department of uh, Communications and Film. All right. My professors were. Let's see. There was Jack Oldfield. There was uh, Tom Carlo. There was. Uh, I can name off lots of professors, but. Which was the professor who taught the basic introduction of film and editing, and he actually worked for a TV station. I don't know. I don't remember which one worked for what. Well, I got Best Student Film of the Year Award. It's still at the uh, KPBS building. It'll have my name with it. Go look it up. Good. Yeah, yeah, student Film of the Year, 1988. And what is that uh, student uh, and Now you're just an asshole cop. Called? What are they called? 
now he's just an asshole cop. What a shame. I, I mean, obviously, you, you're very successful in the film industry. Yeah, fuck you. Did you because, graduate with a TCF major? Oh, sir? no, I, I was a till TCF film student, but I didn't graduate, no. What'd you, when did you finish? Why didn't I finish? No, when did you finish? I left in 97. What'd you do after that? Do you want my life story? No, I work for an ENG production company. You know what ENG is? A uh, what? ENG. ENG? Yes. Electronic News Gathering. Ah. Uh, I mean, you did take those classes. I'm being serious. I mean, if you really went there, let's have dialogue about TCF. And I do believe you if you said you went there. Some of them mentioned, uh, the first guy you mentioned, I remember that professor. Good for you. You did really go there. Yes, I really went. So what happened along the way? Well, let's see what happened along the way. Ten years ago, I yelled at... Bill Horn, the San Diego County Board of Supervisors chairman, and they've destroyed my life ever since. I know for a fact that you are targeting me intentionally. Because I know for a fucking fact that you know that you just don't show up randomly and start fucking You think me. I knew you were here today? I absolutely know you were here. The FBI spent the last 10 years trying to make me into a terrorist, but I keep turning the other cheek, even when assholes like you try to provoke me. Now let me ask you this, so what did this guy do, this council person do? Well, he tried to overturn Prop 215, so some of us protesters went there to stop him. What is Prop 215? Educate me a little bit. Uh, medical marijuana. Okay. Now, do you use medicinal marijuana? Oh, it's really none of your business? No, no, I don't really, it's not going to bother me. I mean, what, I, you know, are you okay? Do you need any medical attention? Are you from San Diego? I'm from your mom's womb, bitch. Well, that makes you my brother. I know. That'd make my mom very upset and it'd be very disappointing. I know. But two of her children ended up with fucked up lives. What, where's the third? It must be me. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it's really good at math. I'm Asian. I'm really good at math. Is that a stereotype? I was saying that because you added one plus one into three. <laughs> well, because they said two of them was a disappointment. It sure wasn't me, so I'm the third. See, I find you kind of not a bad guy. I find you interesting to talk to. You don't use profanity and get vulgar, you know, vulgar on me and threaten me. I mean, you're cool. I like talking to you. You're not a bad guy. Why don't you just leave the people alone? This is now the second day in a row you have come upon me sleeping by myself, not bothering anybody, but Wait, you keep telling out, me to leave out. the people alone. Time out. Time out, please. You know I walk a lot here, right? And yeah, you I keep walk, saying people that. People always say, hey, I think that guy's, I don't know, he looks like he's passed out. I think he's drinking alcohol. They thought your bottle was a vodka bottle. Remember that bottle? They thought it was vodka. They thought you passed out. Really? I tried to explain that to you. No, you actually never you mentioned that bottle until he came back yeah, because 20 I didn't minutes want to later. Deal with your aggression, man. I want really? to officer in case you attack me. Really? So you stood there and harassed me for 20 minutes I'm without not, wanting to deal with my I aggression? I mean, you're cussing at me and talking. The urge to get in that cop car and run that fucking asshole over with his own car is so fucking strong. But I'm nonviolent, damn it. So I'll just document him being an asshole and. If you don't want to talk to me, don't talk to me, but quit yelling at me. Oh dear God. Are you, is your meeting going to happen soon? Because this is really well, getting Well, if old. they have paperwork, they're going to meet me here. If they don't have paperwork, they're not going to meet me here, sir. I mean, that's the bottom line. Why? I mean. Can I stay in your park? Is that okay with you? Can I have your permission? I mean, honestly, that's the problem here. Is if you guys get too entitled. You entitled. take a section of the area thinking it's yours, and when people show up, you look at them with disdain, like, what are you doing in my park, my beach, my sidewalk? You gotta understand, people live here. People live in this park, do they? Well, they people come here to enjoy the park. Now it's Major League Baseball. A lot of Little League kids are all over the place. Okay, maybe really? Because the right park looks here. pretty fucking empty to me. What's that? Well, if you walk it's an empty park. They'll be over there. They've been playing all day. They've been playing all day. Today. Yeah. Six, seven. Seven. Empty. Uh, that's empty. That's empty. This one over here is empty, but yeah. Go on, go on telling your lie of the well, moment. It's not a lie. I mean, if people can see for themselves. Why would I lie about people this? People can see that there's nobody at that it field. Is, uh, there's nobody at that field. There's nobody at that field, but you insist that there's all kinds of little league activity going on right now. There's a lot of little league when you're passed out here. We're sleeping, sorry. Let me ask you this. Uh, why are you so hostile? 
because you are deliberately provoking me. How am I? You, I'm not cussing. You're the one calling me a bunch of names, including the R. Because one. you're deliberately provoking me. Well, how about this? I'm gonna talk to my officer. Oh, there's one of my officers right now. He's parking under the shade of that tree. Hey, Brad, what's up? Hey, just don't approach us, sir. That's all I ask. Why? It's a public park. I can go I wherever the fuck I want. Me. You can come near me. Just stay with it, Ron, because I don't know if you have a knife. Or, I mean, I saw a knife earlier on in your backpack. Just relax. Hey, uh, you found it. So I'll just be cute. Asshole. That's actually good. All right, okay, that's enough. This I is thought a, two arms length. That's a, well, this, it's a public park. I'm allowed to stand okay, wherever I like. Not the vehicle, sir, because I don't know what you're capable of doing. No, After you have no idea what I'm capable of, son. Like, well, in all, what are, you, are you threatening me right now, please? In all the things that's happened recently, man, I don't want you coming any closer. Then why would you provoke me deliberately? I don't know. You have paper? No. If you have black bags, shut up. She say hello. I think if he was worried for his safety, he wouldn't be deliberately provoking people, but you know, to each their own, I guess. We're having a discussion. It's a public park. I think I was just told this is a public park and anyone's allowed to be anywhere as long as it's not within two arms length. They're discussing things that can't be... Uh... Well, maybe they shouldn't be discussing that in a public park then, huh? I really do mean that. Sir, I'm having a, a, a confidential conversation. I tried to tell, I gave you I'm standing in a public park, son. You can arrest me or you can go fuck yourself. Yeah, he was wearing a man dress last time. Yeah, he actually posted a bunch of negative things about you. Well, that's getting boring. What's that? The female cop that you say finally there's a hashtag that nice. Oh, that's going viral now. It's getting a about a thousand hits an hour. How long ago was that? Uh, about a week and a half, two it weeks ago. It was in Newport? It was in uh, uh, Pacific Beach. Oh, that was in Pacific Beach. I got over to the 17. meeting right around my sleeping bag just coincidentally not not over there where they were actually parked when I arrived they could have stayed there but for some reason they're all doing their little meeting here but it's not harassment or anything it's not harassment or anything though right Then why would you intentionally provoke me I, over and you, over you, again? It's your park. Let me ask you. Well, it's not. It is not my park. Okay. Then uh, can we come here? Is that okay? Absolutely. Okay. Then thank you. Okay. You got paper? Yeah. He's, he's pulling it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Matt actually showed up with some paper. You just have to train him out. Good job. Officer, I want to commend you for a good job. Thank you, sir. But you want to bet that's not how we talk to them when the camera's not going. Yeah, yeah, yeah he does. He does. That's unbelievable. He's all, all professional. I'll get, get looking all day long. My wife's going to get out Maybe get some sympathy because I have to deal with all day. Hey, dude, hey, you can just stand by your car. Right I can now. stand where the fuck I want. It's a public park. Can you not use me? Hey, there's kids. You see the kids right over there? Yeah. They're using that language. You think they could hear me? I'm yeah, pretty they sure they can't can hear me. We have to three or deal with your stress right now, seriously. I mean, you can hold the camera, you can video all you want, but quit using profanity. You understand the First Amendment, don't you? Yeah, I didn't say you couldn't. I just say please don't do it. Because
because it's not necessary. Only with mutual respect, right? That's mutual all. respect Wait. from I this cocksucking piece of shit who's been harassing me over and over again. Your sergeant's a piece of shit who's been harassing me, well, you so don't talk really about it. When, when you said, no, I never gave one of the officers the middle finger, and then we showed you a picture of it. That's not what happened. You said, today. And then you said, well... No, you said, I flipped someone off today, and since I hadn't, I told you the truth. Then you showed me a picture from a different day when I had flipped someone off. So who's the liar? Who's the liar? Stop the sidewalk with all your stuff. Who's the liar? That would be oh, you. I wasn't talking. So oh yeah, exactly. It's your, it's your, it's your sergeant, sergeant lying, oh, hold on. The doofus. Oh, okay. Well, we'll stop. We'll stop swearing till the kids are gone. How about that? I appreciate that. Thank you. Man, a problem. These officers are so awesome. They get people's dogs out of trees and only help people and blah blah blah. Gosh darn it! They're such great cops. You were lying oh. about uh, when I flipped off cops, which, by the way, is now officially today. What is, what is it you're trying to prove right now? What am I trying to no, prove? I'm just curious. I, I just met you. I don't even know what's going on. I, I have a feeling it. you do know what's going on, but I we'll leave that. We'll, we're we'll leave that. The FBI. I, have no, no idea. I, I don't think it's a coincidence that your sergeant now three times has decided to make up a lie about being flagged down so he can come over and intentionally harass me. Uh, I, I don't. Our, our UC too. He knew, he knew he was our undercover. Oh. The transient that walked by. Here it comes. I was telling him he called out our undercover. Yeah, it's yeah. so boring. Uh, uh, make sure. I mean, I can't it's there. not even worth. This is getting so boring. It's not even worth recording anymore. So you know, I'm sure I'll see him again. But for now, fuck me. Hold on. No, what? I, I was going to say, I don't want him to get us uh, eating the donuts if he can. Do you mind not getting us a. Uh, hey, you know what? Eating? It's been a long day. You guys deserve it over the globe. I've been fantastic. Because, you know, we, then we're going to fit into that stereotype of eating donuts. How about fitting in the stereotype of intentionally harassing yet again? See what happens when I start moving quickly towards them. Oh, it's a public park. Okay, but you. It's a public park, sweetheart. I can do whatever I want. Don't call me sweetheart. Okay, ma'am. Yeah, it's just a coincidence that they're holding their meeting right here and that I'm surrounded by police cars. I tell you folks, I've gone through some weird things in my life, but I don't think I've ever experienced something quite as creepy as taking a shower while a police sergeant watches me the whole time. 30 minutes earlier. And then it was my nemesis, the infamous Sergeant Yu. You know what, quit harassing my officer. How you doing, sir? Happen, you need to lay off everybody, right? I just said hello. I just said hello, sir, calm down. I said hello, your officers say hello to me. See in a bad moon? See in a bad, see, you still said hello to me, right? I said, how you doing? Yeah, I just said that to him when he started yelling and cursing at me. See in a bad mood or something? Well, a lot of us are. I don't know if you pay attention to the news. What's going on in the news? Oh my God, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry, man. I get what you're doing. I just said hello to him, that's it. 
I want you to record. All these things are going on with Austin. I don't want you constantly harassing my officer when they're doing the job. Do you understand? You do what you need to do with that camera, but leave people alone. They said leave hello to me. No, no, no. They were being nice. You're harassing the other officers. If you turn on that camera the way you please, go and record. Leave the officers alone. Aw. He's, he's going to get an Oscar. That guy, he, he deserves an Oscar. It's a very, very believable uh, performance. Woo. And just for the record, there were four homeless people killed and one police officer killed. When the homeless people were killed, these cops were harassing me. I was trying to get them to, I don't know, the guy who hit me with the rock in the head. They refused to investigate it. I was constantly harassed by Sergeant Yu himself. And if you look at the other videos, you see he specifically sought me out and relentlessly harassed me. So now this is what I get from the guy, really. You know, I have sympathy. I, I'm sorry one of your officers was killed, but you know what, let's put it in perspective. Now, okay, can't wait for another time. Four homeless people were killed and you didn't give a shit, son. So don't talk to me about one dead officer. Four homeless people and you fucking tortured me. So don't give me that shit. That's don't give me right. that shit, You're son. Yeah, fuck you. You can't expect sympathy from me when you were harassing me while homeless people were being murdered. So, you know, put it in perspective a little bit. Did you just warn them that I'm harassing your officers? I want you back off, sir. Seriously, I'm here talking to life, but why do you always cause me harassment? You were just you intentionally know? talking about me really loud. That's right here. I told you not to do that. Oh, it's that right here? You're going to give me the, the, the glass ticket? Oh, Jesus. You know, four homeless people were killed, and not only did you... Don't come any closer, Great. Right? Four homeless people... Anymore, do you ever stop talking? People, right? You've been harassing me for a month. Four homeless people were killed, and you didn't give a shit. And now you want me to cry about your one officer? Stop harassing people, and maybe you won't have all these problems. All you've done is torture me for the last month, Sergeant You. So don't talk, go around telling people uh, that I'm a problem when you won't leave me alone. Four homeless people were killed, and you people wouldn't even investigate the attack on me. So don't even give me that bullshit. Yeah, turn your back on me because you're an asshole. Four homeless people were killed. He didn't give a shit. One cop's killed, and he's being an asshole to me. I didn't do it. So after a month of being harassed by you, me staring at you is causing a problem. Seth, did you not follow me over here? I'm over here to take a shower. You're not following me over here, sir. I did because you were being a hypocrite. You intentionally said really loud to the lifeguards that I'm a problem. So, you know, let's put things in perspective, son. So you think I can take a shower without Sergeant Hugh bothering me, or is he going to come and complain about uh, what kind of soap I'm using or something? gave me a ticket. Of course they did. Have a nice day, gentlemen. That was fairly predictable, as is this narc here. What's up, narc? Hello, dude. Well, I'm now across the street from the beach so I can drink my water out of a glass bottle without being arrested. 
They said if they see me with a glass bottle again, they will arrest me and I will spend three to five days in county. What's that? I didn't hear you. Jesus, what do you want now? Sergeant. <sighs> I had headphones in. I had headphones in, I didn't hear what you said to me. Jesus Christ, this psycho, dude. How psycho is this guy? Pulls up on me at the bus stop, says something, yells something to me, I don't hear him. I go to ask him and he freaks out and runs away. How many do I get? He just waited behind this building. When the bus came, he said, that's one bus. He's counting how many buses. I'm not talking to you, officer. I'm talking to that officer. Yeah, you are. What's up? You calling me a cop? I'm talking to that cop. What are you doing? What's it look like I'm doing? I'm picking up litter. Okay, so why are you talking to me? Because I'm asking if you're going to help or not. If I'm going to help you pick up litter? Yeah. Do I look like I'm going to help you pick I up litter? I have no idea. The answer is no. Figures. Yeah, I know. I had my own life. And then you came along right when Sergeant you pulled up and started harassing me. That's weird. You got off the bus that he's watching me on and then started shit with me. But you're not a cop. That'd be silly of me to think that. What? I said it'd be totally silly of me to think you're a cop, right? There's no, I mean, <laughs> that's just silly. Anywho, just before that bus came, Sergeant you came around. He went all the way around. He was behind this building when the bus came, and as soon as the bus left, he pulls out of that alley and tells me, that's one bus. He's counting how many buses I sit at the bus stop for so he can give me a ticket once I've broken the law. But he's not harassing me. I tell you, it's a little creepy to have a police sergeant do that. Now Sergeant Yu's walking by me, and as he walked by me, he said he was documenting how long I've been sitting here. I gotta keep the camera on the whole time. This guy. This guy's something else, this Sergeant Yu. So let's go. Talk to Sergeant Yu. I just got him looking around the corner there. Let's chase this cop down and see what he's up to. So he was just peeking around the corner and there he is. Morning, Sergeant. How are you doing today? You know, you've been harassing my officers back up and uh, have a good day on your own. Is he pretending that he wasn't just stalking me at the bus stop? That's interesting. Let's see what Sergeant Hughes is up to, huh? So after harassing me at the bus stop, he walks over here to the spot where I sleep. Interesting. Ah, uh, looking for someone. I'm sure I'll see you again, Sergeant Yu. So just to recap, I was sitting on that bench. Sergeant Yu came by, he kept circled the building a few times. He pulled up next to me, but too far forward for me to be able to hear what he was saying. Then pulled up there. When I went to ask him what he was saying, he drove off. The bus came, then he came and said, oh, that was one. Then when I realized he was hiding there, I walked up there. Once I caught him hiding there, he immediately went all the way over, investigated where I sleep, got in his car and left. That seems strange to you? 
but he's not messing with me. No, that's just silly. That's just insane to think that.